Hello, I will be your narrator for this film. They hired me because I have a cool accent and because this movie doesn't make a goddamn bit of sense. So I'm going to try to explain it all to you as we go along. A long time ago in a land we made up, the kinky peasant hath found the sacred raspberry scented tea candle of Balsmore. Whomever possesses it controls all of the land of Loinwart where this film takes place. See, I told you this shit doesn't make any sense. Unfortunately, the kinky peasant is about to encounter the evil hellhound named Petey. <laughs> Petey is the evil lapdog servant of Satan, the evil ruler of Demon's Perch, a dark and treacherous area of Bolsmore. Satan is eviler than evil itself. kill Gunnar Steedwell. He is the only thing standing between us and world domination. Satan dispatched his secretary all off the gravedigger to kill Gunnar Steedwell, the son of Gunnar Steedhorn, the servant of God. <laughs> I'm <laughs> 
Legion's henchmen, all off the Gravedigger, killed poor Gunner Steedwell in cold blood. Now Satan and Olaf were one step closer to controlling Loinwort. There was only one thing in their way, and his name was Gunner Steedhorn. Before me, Gunner Steedhorn, I will help you defeat the armies of evil, but you must not pussyfoot around. Please don't mind me holding my arms like this, but it's from an it's from an underarm rash achieved through varsity wiffle ball. <laughs> All off the grave digger would ride day and night on his evil woolly mastodon searching for Gunner Steedhorn and searching for the sacred raspberry-scented tea candle of Bolesmore, which would give him and Satan control of the whole land of Loinwort. Fortunately, Satan's lapdog Beatty dropped the tea candle on his way back to Demon's Perch, and it was found by a kind and gentle soul, the redneck wizard. The redneck wizard lived in the sacred woods of Alabama and was Gunner Steedhorn's mentor, teacher, and drinking buddy. This must be that sacred candle Buffo was talking about. Now the sacred raspberry-scented tea candle of Bolesmore was in good hands. But before Gunner Steedhorn could reach the redneck wizard and the sacred tea candle, he would have to travel through the evil forest of Gobblesmore, and he would have to face its guardian, the evilest of evil, Nailzar. Fortunately, the gods of nature helped Gunnar Steedhorn on his journey. We, we are, are the, the gods, gods of, of nature. nature. Thunder, strike down on the enemies of Gunnar Steedhorn. When I beseech thee by the mighty powers of hell, may a black arrow of death be put through all the wind that comes this way. Cut off the god of the wind's head and release all his evil. Earth, shake, rattle, and roll the enemies of Gunner Steedhorn. <laughs> 